Today, Simon visited Llandog Hospital Radio to see their brand new studios, Rukud Sam. Uh, that is Keen somewhere only we know on Rookwood Sam, broadcasting 24 hours a day to the hospitals of uh, Rookwood and Llandog. Uh, it's the morning show with me, Charlie Brown, coming up today at uh, 1 o'clock. Well, we're here today, Charlie, because um, these are brand new studios for Rookwood Sound. Why did Rookwood Sound need new studios? Well, it all started when the... Uh, Cardiff and Vale Health Board decided that uh, Rookwood Hospital had reached the end of uh, its life. Although we broadcast to both these hospitals and are still at the moment continuing to broadcast to these two hospitals, uh, it's going to be obviously a continuation with uh, the service we provide because Rookwood Hospital, a large bulk of it, uh, will be moving out to uh, these premises probably within about the, the next nine months, I would think. Uh, everything will be be ready to make the move from from Rookwood Hospital. What are the differences here between uh, between here and your your uh, your old setup at Rookwood Hospital? I suppose the the main difference is a ability to be able to be seen uh, by not only the staff but also by. Um, the the patients on a you know because patients keep going past here on trolleys or what have you or in wheelchairs uh, so we're a much much more visible presence uh, within within the hospital it must be quite satisfying being able to come in sit in front of a microphone play some great music and and communicate with what is really a quite a captive audience absolutely I mean I love the fact that I can play music that I love and hopefully bring music to people that they've never heard because it's not necessarily on your you know, your normal radio playlists. And, and as you say, a captive audience. And, and, and as we were speaking earlier off air, I've spent a lot of time in hospital over the years and, and really appreciate that listening to, listening to hospital radios. And, and I always thought that sometimes someone would make you laugh. Uh, and if it made you laugh once later on in the day, if you're having a bad day, all of a sudden you thought of that and it made you smile. So I just think to myself, right, if I can play one record somebody likes or make somebody laugh once, then Perhaps I've done my job for the day and yeah, that's, yeah, it's really good. I, I enjoy that part of it. I'm guessing part of the job is getting out and meeting the patients. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It, um, and it is lovely to meet the patients. And also, you, there's an awful lot of people coming here for outpatient appointments and it's great to meet those, you know. It just is, yeah, it's really, really good. And, and it is nice that um, it's a benefit to be able to, to speak to people who you actually are playing music for as opposed to playing it blandly for people you don't even know. They might be driving their cars or their vans, you know. So yeah, it is nice to be able to meet the people. The main thing is to be here and provide a service overall. And it's not just to the patients, it's also to the staff and uh, people who work here. We've been uh, very active and actively involved with uh, the uh, various carol services and Easter concerts here in uh, pushing that out around the hospital so that everybody gets a chance to, to hear what's uh, going on.